Hi guys, it's Frankie from Frankie Tech, and here's my epic charge test number four, featuring all the same phones that I drained the other day. So we have the list, the ROG 2, ROG Phone 2, Black Shark 2 Pro, Mi 9T, Xiaomi CC9, Mi A3, and Oppo K3. And here you're seeing the footage of me plugging in the phones into my control strip, the power strip there. Charging specs out of the box here for almost all the phones. ROG 2 is using 18 watt charge, but it can go up to 30. Black Shark 2 Pro is 27 watts. Mi 19 CC9 are 18 watt fast charge. The Mi A3 can also go up to 18, but I'm using the standard 10 watt charger. And then we got the K3, which is actually using the warp charge, which is super VOOC technology as well. Here's the Redmi K20 Pro that's going to be keeping time and plan B as well, the pocket watch. And in three, two, one, let's go. And so here you can see I just plugged, I turned on the power strip and all the phones are turning on. But I wanted to wait until they were fully on here. I will be keeping the, the phones powered on for 30 minutes here, but with the screens off, let's see how we do after 30 minutes. 30 minutes in, what are the results so far? We have the ROG Phone 2 at 27%, a lot of different numbers here. Black Shark 2 Pro, 56, tied with the K3 at 56, and the other phones are in the 40 range, but the Mi A3 is way down there, also at 27%. How are we gonna do at 45 minutes? 45 minutes in, what are the results here? We have the ROG Phone 2 at 41, the Black Shark 2 Pro at 76, all the other phones are in the 60s, the Mi A3 though down to 36, but the K3 is moving up 82%. It's going to be done with this test very soon. Let's see how we do after one hour. One hour in, what are the results? And now there are a number of phones moving towards 100%, Black Shark 2 Pro and the K3 are in the 90 range with the Mi A3 behind at 83, but there's a few phones here like the Mi A3 that are still way down below 50%. But the K3 is coming up first. It's going to be the one to get there, I think. And let's see how we do here. With 1% left, when is it going to hit it? When is it going to win this? Quick charge test. There it is. And with a final time of 1 hour, 11 minutes, the Oppo K3 using that 30 watt Super Vook slash Warp Charge has won this. And now what are the results at 1 hour 15? We got a number of phones, Black Shark 2 Pro, Mi 9T, moving close to the 100% range. CC9 is at 88%, but the ROG 2 and Mi 3 are far behind. I think the Black Shark 2 Pro is up next. Let's have a look. Second place coming up any minute now, and there it is. And in second place, the Black Shark 2 Pro with a time of 1 hour and 24 minutes. A solid result here from this awesome gaming phone. And the last time I'll be checking all the scores, one hour and 30 minutes, a number of phones hitting, hitting that 100% very soon. The ROG Phone 2 is moving into the 80 range soon, and the Mi A3 is at 71. And now any minute, we're waiting for the next placing here, and there it is, third place, the Mi 9T with a respectable one hour and 40 minute charge time, pretty decent overall. And following closely on its heels, here we have the Xiaomi CC9. There it goes with a time of 1 hour and 53 minutes. Finds itself in fourth place. And then there were two. And the two that did so well in the drain test aren't doing too great in this charge test. And the next phone was up. And there it is. Fifth place, the ROG Phone 2 with a time of 2 hours and 21 minutes. So only one phone remaining. And this paltry 10 watt charging is just not good for the Mi A3. It's too bad they don't include the 18 watt charger in the box because there it goes that was it and in sixth place the Mi A3 with a 10 watt charge time of two hours and 30 minutes not good if you're gonna get this phone get the 18 watt charger and there are the results guys happy to share them on Twitter very soon but thanks for watching this quick charge test number four like subscribe stay tuned for more great content coming soon and this is Frankie Tech signing off have a good one